What up everybody, welcome to, as you probably guessed by the title, trying to hunt the most expensive knives in CSGO. Now I might not have every single knife on this list. Let's dive into the ones I'm trying to get. Firstly, the Karambit Doppler. Obviously it can come in very many expensive variations, but we'll even settle for just a base value one, a phase four. Next up on our hit list, it is the Karambit Case Harden. If you don't know, well, if we manage to unbox a legendary Blue Gem edition of the Case Hardened, it would be worth a hell of a lot of money, let's just say that. Moving on to the Karambit Fade, an exceptionally expensive knife and one of my absolute favourites. I had to have it in here. A fairly newer knife this time around with a skeleton knife. Obviously, we'd be hunting a Case Hardened and once again, we'll be looking for that Blue Gem Edition. The Law Knives, I'm also exceptionally partial for. That's why the M9 Bayonet Law is on this list. And of course, we can't forget the Butterfly Law. That is a sick knife as well. Followed up by the Butterfly Knife Marble Fade. Super expensive, super rare, super cool. Let's try and get one. And we can't forget the Butterfly Doppler. I think Butterfly Knives are the most expensive knives out of all knives just by base value. And if we could get a Ruby or a Sapphire or an Emerald Butterfly Knife Doppler, that would just be insane. And last but not least, we have the Karambit Gamma Doppler. I think you're probably sensing a little theme here with the Dopplers and the Case Hardens. But if we hit the special variation, of these patterns, we've won the game. I have accumulated 350 cases, all different types of weapon cases, specifically with the knives that we're looking for in them. The odds from pulling a knife from a case are about one in 385 or so, so technically we don't have enough cases to average out to one knife, but. Fingers crossed, we get lucky today. Let's dive straight in to the Chroma 3. These, of course, have the Karambit Doppler in. That is what we're trying to unbox from them. It's been a while. It's been a while since I opened some of these cases, and it's going to be quite a fun adventure. I already feel it. Little trip down memory lane with all of these skins we haven't seen for ages. Unfortunately, Chroma 3 case, in terms of actual skins, like weapon skins that aren't knives, not fantastic. And even the higher tier, Santito's Fire is all right. That would probably be the best out of all of these skins, but everything else is pretty trash. We've got a lot of cases to get through, so I say we speed open some. Speed open isn't popping up the weapons. It's just appearing in my inventory, but let's get through all of these Chroma 3s with the classic speed open. Ooh, our first pink, the P250 Asimov in field tested. 30 Chroma 3s down already. Not looking great. No Karambit Doppler. Let's move on to the Spectrum 2s. From this case specifically, we're hunting the Butterfly Knife Marble Fade. Oh, that's nice. Straight off the bat, Stat Track Leaded Glass. Another Leaded Glass, not Stat Track though. Ooh, High Roller, bring on the Classifieds. Another Leaded Glass. A whole lot of Classifieds so far. I can't complain too much. But 50 Spectrum 2 cases down and no butterfly knife marble fade to show for it, unfortunately, unless it's on this very last one. It's not. The classifieds are all right, but I feel like I have more luck in matchmaking, so let's hop in a little game and then open the rest of these. Next up is the Gammas. Obviously, we want the M9 Bayonet Law. That would be incredible. Let's get some of these open. Little Desert Eagle Directive. I have not seen this guy in age to me that M9 bayonet lore. I don't want any of this P250 ironclad stuff, any of this PP Bison Harvester stuff. I'm not about that. I want to see some knives today. That's the reason we're here. We hunting them sick knives. Give me one key. I open you. I can't give you a key, unfortunately. I stopped that a long time ago. Otherwise I would. I'd do that. Three Gamma 2s left. Let's get them. Three, two, and one. No knife. We're not done with the gammas yet, uh, though. The gamma I twos know, are done. You? We got 20 more gammas to go. Man long. <laughs> what? Should really be letting them roll just for the satisfying animation in case we hit a rare special item. Mmm, no focus, though. Not in stat track. Oh, what was that? What was that bait from the Gamma, the Cobra, and the very final Gamma case, our M9 Bayonet Raw Dream. It's about to go whizzing past out the window, just like 
that. Next up is the Dreams and Nightmares case, and it has the Butterfly Knife lore in. Hmm, Night Terror, not a bad start. Long. Should probably get back to the game though and start opening cases. What is that warpy boy? He's warpy. How laggy is that guy? That makes sense. He's got like 100 ping. Strong arm. That's 6 2. And for some reason, I've ended up top fragging despite having to spam opening cases all game. So let's get back to that. It seems to be working for us quite well. How many restricteds did we get in a row there? Three restricteds in a row from the Park dream snipers. What's up, dude? Me? You. Do you want to trade for my old skins? I'm, I'm good. I've got my own skins, thank you. Little case for good luck on the rush. Speed open. One city, one shot. There we go. As long as my job is done, I can get back to my real job. Hunting the sickest knives known to exist in the game. The latte, you've come to join me. Have you, buddy? Well, we're definitely not getting a knife anymore. The unlucky cat has arrived. It's a whole lot of blues in the chat. That's not this one. He was not ready. He's oh, dead. got to be dead. Good. Save, save, save. <laughs> nice. Save me. We need Dragon Lord. I give you up. Sure. Lord, nice. Pretty nice. Goes too, dude. It's pretty nice. I like the sticker. Take a joy. Me pushing. So we can change. We can change. Slap this. <laughs> no trade. I'll keep. Come on. Thanks for guy. GG. GG, fellas. GG. Good luck in the opening. Thank you. I need it, dude. Quite astounded, I managed to top frag while just spam opening cases all game. And Gaben blessed me with a little orb contractor, how very kind of him. And the final dreams and nightmares, we'll let it roll. It's our very last shot at the butterfly knife war. Not today. Moving on to the spectrums, it would be amazing to get that butterfly knife Doppler. Emerald, the most expensive version of it? I might have to quickly look that up, because that annoys me that I don't know that off the very top of my head. You can actually only get the emerald from butterfly knife gamma dopplers, not normal dopplers. So what we would be hoping for instead would be a sapphire, full blue version of the butterfly knife. But not many spectrum cases left to make that happen. Ooh, our first covert. Very cool. The Neo Noir. What condition is it in? Field tested. But it's nice to get a covert. Final spectrum. We'll let it roll. Show me that nice shiny yellow rare special. Mm. Moving on to the fractures. We are hoping, of course, for the skeleton knife blue gem. That would be absolutely mad. This case does actually have one skin in. Actually, Legion of Anubis isn't too bad. Let's say two skin. But primarily, the Desert Eagle Prince Dream, that's a nice one. It's rare, it's expensive, and in some cases can be even more expensive than a knife. Final fracture case, this marks 50 fracture cases. Boom, speed open, just like that. And unfortunately, it doesn't look like we're gonna have any skeleton knife blue gem to show for it. The only cases we have left are the revolver cases, and the phoenix cases, of which we would be hoping to hit a Karambit Fade, or a Karambit case hardened, obviously, Blue Gem Edition. These are a little more old school, which I personally love. The OG skins tend to be my absolute favorite. We got the Orp Azzy in here. We got the Red Line, what an absolute classic. Very final Phoenix case, we'll let it roll. Give the case a little shaky shake for good luck. Hmm. And now we have nothing but revolvers left. I don't like any of the skins <laughs> in this collection at all. So the only good thing we could really get at all would be a knife. 50 of these to go, 300 cases already open. It's not looking incredibly likely that we're going to get that knife. But hey, we're not entirely out just yet. Oh, I knew! I knew the minute I saw all these terrible skins in this case that we'll probably hit a covert in this one. And that's definitely not the cobra that we wanted to hit a field tested royal paladin about five five pound i don't know if we're gonna get any knives oh the point disarray actually the most acceptable skin from the entire case very final revolver case let's let it roll from tradition i can't really accept this massive massive loss 
So I'm going to take out a whole bunch of shattered web cases from my investments and we're going to open 50 of these. This extra 50 cases will mean we've gone above and beyond the 380 something required to actually get a knife. So we're going to get a knife, right? That's how it works. We'd obviously be hoping for the, oh, that's not too bad, skeleton knife, case hardened, blue gem edition from the shattered webs. Oh, we're hitting some really nice skins. I'm really hoping today is the day that we break curse of this guy right here because it seems like whenever he is on my lap it's just absolutely impossible to pull anything whatsoever some people think i'm a little mean for just blaming my cat but i actually want the best for him i want to be able to pull this knife so we can finally break the curse the mr latte no luck curse and <laughs> now it's over very final case very final key, Mr. Latte, give you a stroke for good luck. Oh, the stroke's not coming in. And that brings a conclusion to opening 400 cases. We didn't even get a gut knife. We didn't even get like the worst knife possible. We didn't even get a little flip, a little Nava jar, a little fountain, safari mesh. I would have taken one of those. We didn't beat the odds today, but tomorrow's another day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see me hunt more sick knives, Smash that like button. And from me and Mr. Latte right here on my lap, I bid you farewell. Thank you all so, so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.